Hey everyone, so today we like to open this book for the dads that are out there, the dads that are trying. Today on uh, Parental Alienation Awareness Day, and we just like to show this book to some dads to inspire you all to continue being a good father, keep being there for your children, keep practicing patience. This is for you. I just want to say thank you to all the dads that are out there that are still trying. Thank you so much. I know if I had my dad, I'd be able to thank him if he was would have been would have tried hard enough. And um, just thank you so much for to all the fathers out there that are still trying, that are still involved in their children's lives, that are still supporting their kids, still get them to work. I know it's not easy, but um, I just want to say thank you and um, just keep doing what you're doing. Remember. The kind of man you want to be as a man, as a father, as a human being. Just remember that today and always. This book is not my book. I mean, it's not my my children in the book. It's uh, someone else's, but I just wanted to um, inspire some of the fathers that are out there, some of the fathers that are dealing with um, parental alienation today. Um, if there's anything any father needs right now, it's their children, that time with their children. And it's it's very it can be very hard when we have women that are and I know I'm a woman I'm speaking you know um, speaking about women yes I am because um, there is women like my mother who um, had so much ego had so much pride and would never want to work with my dad and of course it was also him as well he didn't want to work with her um, a lot of people have problems that they don't solve they don't think they need to solve for the sake of the children but if you are one of those fathers that um, if you are one of those fathers who is still trying want you to know that even if you don't see it right now even if you don't see it your children are going to be thankful for you for you being there for them they're gonna be very thankful I know you don't see it I know um, it can be very difficult when you're in a situation where you're not appreciated or you're not um, valued by the woman she doesn't say thank you she doesn't show how thankful she is and um, it can be difficult but um, 
just keep going. Keep going. Keep being the dad and the man that you want to be for your kids. Because it's up to you to make the choices to be a better person, to be there for your children. And I know women can be, we all can be tough, right? We can be really mean sometimes. Sometimes we can be cruel. But um, I just hope and I pray that um, you find um, women that aren't cruel, that aren't egotistic, that aren't um, so prideful and so much in need for control that they take away children from the father. And I know right now that porn has a big... Um, big influence on men right now. So we're hoping that um, the men that are watching this video, that play this video, this message is for you. For you that struggle, if you struggle for, if you struggle with your image, you struggle with your appearance, if you struggle with um, your weight, your height, your um, body parts, remember who you are. Remember that God created men to be providers and protectors and to love their children and to love women from their hearts not from false images and um, you know it's really hard right now we're in a world where there's a lot of um, temptation out there a lot of it is free but every day as a man you have a choice to wake up and be a better man, to be a good man, to be someone that your children can be proud of, so that when you're no longer here, you can be praised for what you did do. Okay? That's what you need to think about. Think about what you did do. So sorry, I'm trying to make this video and hoping that it reaches a man's heart and it reaches a man's soul. And it inspires a man right now who really needs it to know that you are good enough and you do matter. And you are valued and you are appreciated and a lot of women are thankful for the men that still provide and protect their families and still value the home the woman the marriage the relationship and um, of course most importantly the children